hi guys welcome back to our channel today we have some hauls so let's start off i found this new shop um by the easter market well detroit easter market and it's called was wabi sabi um 313 pre-love vintage and modern wear so they focus more and i'm gonna put in the description boxes their name down below if you are from metro detroit area give them a follow i will put their link so um they are um mostly like for what do you call this for um like clothing and i'm very careful when i do that just because um i get my clothes from salvation army usually like for a dollar or really cheap because I get it when they're in really good shape. However, they have a clearance rack and I saw these and I fell in love with it. It is an oversized like, um, like what do you call this? Like sweater, sleeveless sweater and I just love it. As you can see, it's ultra big on me. It's almost like a dress, but this will be cute for leggings i just love like the print of it and they were 15 dollars. so y'all yeah. i actually went back for that and then i saw this too and i have to show you because um i'll probably keep one and then i'll probably like um like maybe like put one on my shop I'm not sure yet because I don't really think that the wall art has to be like together but I'm not sure we'll figure it out together so anyhow they are this really cool oops did I break it pottery piece right here so they are very identical to each other so yeah it's just like a cool little um vibe and this is contemporary clay design for uh, myers florida so it is called blue and it is marked in the back so let me just oh wow they marked it down. They, um, so, okay. This is the marking right here. So, and then, like I said, so it goes, the hang, so the artist thinks about hanging it like this way, which is kind of cool. However, like I said, there's two of them. But I guess now that I'm looking at it, I probably need to like sell this as a set. Um, I'm not sure. And there are each like signed. Um, it's called green and then mavi. And what's the other one? So it's like this. So, because like this is where the hanging piece is. So. They want you to hang it like this. So should you be hanging it like this then? Is that how it goes? I'm not sure. Maybe that makes sense. Because if you see, I have a glass top right here for my crafting. So the big triangle is kind of like pink and then blue. And then the other one is like the opposite of it. So and then... This one says blue, and then this one says green. I don't understand why there's green. There's nothing that is green in this piece. If anything, this is pink. So it says green. So it says green right here, and then mauve right here. But you know what? We didn't make this. If the artist says that that's what they wanted to call it, who are we to judge? So, 
we're just gonna put those pieces right here and then um, I'm gonna show you because I asked my husband to go sourcing today so I did so we went to my favorite because I had to I had to drop off some orders but we got this beautiful piece right here and I have seen her before and I'm not sure if you can capture um, her but she has a different texture on them she is kind of like glazed and then her face like the everything except for let's take a look at her oh her fingers are broken no her fingers are not broken that's just how no yeah it is oh that's okay she's still cute anyhow um her face and her hands are satin finish and then she has a marking she's an Italian design it says Italy style and it's the Monte right there and she has like a little bit of an issue right here um, but you can't really see it so I'm not even sure if it's like a piece so she is gorgeous so i pick her up um blue is the color for this week so and then i had spotted this my husband did not want me to get this because it's damaged however i have a niche thanks to mav um for like mexican pottery so i have this beautiful cup right here and let me tell you why Brandon did not want me to get it. There's a chip right here by the lip. I don't know if you guys can tell. And then another one right here. And then another one on the bottom right there. And not to mention, there's also some chip on the handle, which is not a problem for me if I'm not reselling it. It's just, and then a, a few chips right here. So these are Mark $5, but she gave it to me for half of that price. And it is Mark Tunala. So I will be using that for my coffee. It's heavy. And then what else do we have in here? I'm just going to pull it down. Okay. I'm almost positive I'm missing something in here. No, I'm not. Okay. So this is the next piece and then this one is also gorgeous so it is this like um, sculpture right here that is bronze so they have like that nice curl with the rock and it has this and it even has like a it has a marking that says patent by but I don't want to I don't know if there's any markings right here. Ooh. Um, nope. Nope. I just basically like ruined the the um, thing. Well, it doesn't have any marking, but it does have like patent by. It doesn't have any signature that I can see, but I thought now I have to glue that. Thanks a lot, Abby. Um, it's just gorgeous. The piece is so weird. It looks like an apple or you can even have like a heart since Valentine's Day is coming. So I got that. And then another thing that I got is this gorgeous piece right over here. So this one um, is like a little um, kind of like wall hanger maybe. You could do that. You could do it this way. It's just gorgeous. Um, I love these kind of pieces. Like you could do it like a little like rug. That would look cute with this one actually. All together. Like in a little kind of like vignette. So I picked that up. So yep. I might enjoy these pieces first before I put them in my shop. And then because Valentine's Day is upon us. I actually spotted this two mugs right here that I thought was cute, matchy-matchy, that I will put on my shop. 
it's gonna be available at my ebay shop so what it is though is that there are two matchy matchy mugs right here and they do have a marking that i can't identify it's like that so that would be super cute for like um what do you call this for um valentine's day and then that's it and then i received some packages today so we're just gonna enjoy and open this up before i destroy my pottery piece so we have this and then we shall see what this is it says ebay so can't remember if i have an ebay that i'm supposed to receive half of the time and it says like thank you lolo from florida um funny lolo and um in filipino what well, not filipino in tagalog which is a, a language that i speak where i came from in the philippines the capital city so that's how it's like it's grandfather package so oh okay well i know what this is and it has my name on it so i got this from district and again i'm not sure about you guys but i noticed that this no this is not district this is not district at all i'm sorry so with that note i'm still waiting for a package from district and i got that like the seller did not um put any slip but i'm gonna try to do my best to find that seller so i can show it this one was fun so i got this like really cute um little furry thing right here it has a little ball super gorgeous i don't even know how much i paid for it since i don't have anything and then this was also something really cute it is actually a pill box if i were to use this but the intention of this is a little sewing kit so i don't oops i don't know if i'm going to do that as a sewing kit or does it come off yeah it does come off yeah this thing comes off it's just like a little tape right there but that thing is very handy so i might need to like really put that in something but um i think i like this as a pill box i have yet to use like a signature pill box right here but i have to get a chain for it if you guys remember i had this made in england for harmony kingdom kind of thing that i got oh it has the the thing already i didn't even know that well 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 that's a total game changer because remember i got this little turtle that is like a little inkwell pink pinwell so yeah i'm going to do that it doesn't have any clasp so well we're gonna figure it out and now i can't oh really it has some issues like putting the top no it doesn't have any issue abby you have issues okay we'll put that back it's like commercial all right so put that right there and then those two yep i'm gonna try to find those so now i have three of those fur furry collection oh my gosh so cute um if you are a seller here and i buy from you and you manage to watch my video i would appreciate it if you put like an item list just because it's easy for me to mention you on the time that i'm doing my video so that people can see where i got the um the items from and they maybe they could visit your um what do you call this your shop if they decided to like go to um youtube and i don't know where people are finding this tape that says whatnot that's kind of cute i have to 
figure that one out where they got that from do you buy it at whatnot all right so oh thank you thank you so this is by my michelle 2830 so cute that is the package and she gifted me like a pack of stickers thank you it makes me happy when you guys do that because um that's very cool and i'm gonna show you i'm gonna put her name in the description box down below but just so you can see right now this is her um her handle her um whatnot um shop please give her a follow because i have amazing things in here i have the same one I forgot where I put it from. Oh, oh, this owl is to die for. And I'm going to put this in my planner. And I'm just being lazy, but I'm about to do a planner video. Maybe tomorrow. So I'm going to be with Miss Tracy. So it's well packaged, guys. I have to show you. All right. So that's how it is. Super well packaged. Okay, so we have this item, and then this item, and I think that's it. So I need to show you, because I appreciate this, that the bottom is so um, packed. Like, it's it's very, um, it's not, the word is not um, packed. Like, it's filled. It's cushioned, per se. So, alright. Of course, as usual, I'm all over the place right here. Story of my life. Two items right here. Just gonna give it a throw. <laughs> it's just a box. So, this is how she packaged it. I also do this technique sometimes. Um, the saran wrap technique. I love it. All right, what did we get? I could look it up in there, but this is fun. Oh, I remember this. Okay, so I have one. Okay, oh, I did this. I don't even remember. So I have this beautiful little swan. Um, does it look like red to you or orange? Because I think I bid it bid, bid on that for Tracy because I'm I'm trying to get her to like vintage. And then the other piece right here is this cute little poodle brooch. Mm, right there. So let me see if I actually purchased that poodle. Oh she was just so nice to give it to me. Uh yeah. Oh my God, she gifted me that. That's what I thought. I don't remember doing that. Well, thank you, thank you. I love it. I am definitely gonna use it. I would. I like putting those kind of things in my hat. So I'll take a picture and I'll show you. So I purchased this from her, super nice. If you all know me, I love these kind of art glass, so. And then there's two, so I'm going to show you the other one before I break it. So, thank you so much. Okay. I love how she packaged it. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, yeah, that is for Tracy. It's is it red or orange? I swear, it kind of like looks like red. I love the contour mat. I just like touching it. It looks like it's elegant touching. <laughs> I know, I'm weird. I'm also a little tired. We had a long day today. Um, I really wanted to start walking. And today was great because it's our first day of snow. And outside is beautiful. And it's not that cold. Okay. So this is the other swan that I purchased from her. This one looks like the rest of my swans. So um, I don't know. I don't know if this is red. Um, Tracy won't care. 
I'm just literally just trying for her to like um thrifting because this is this is how it works guys if you are watching my channel tracy is my best friend the way that it works our friendship is that i am we're both excited but i am the one that that likes to explore different things and then i get her wound up and then she ended up like like liking it like perfect example she never really care about like crafting like um like she is crafty herself but she doesn't really like like um dive deep to it so i got so crazy with like um crickets like the cricket the cutting machine that i have two of those i got the big one the maker and then the personal one which she has because i want her to try it but um where do i have it i can't remember if she if i let her borrow it no i think i might have it here she has the mug press because she loves to bedazzle the traveling um mug so she that's her niche but it takes so long because she hand bead them so but yeah so and now i'm trying to get her to and then i got her into planning so now she's obsessed about that uh meaning to say like the planner community so yeah so and then i'm trying to get her round up with like gardening but um the problem is gardening is weird because you really have to like i really have to be there and then help her like how to make it easy for her because she's very busy because she manages like a store we work for the same company but she's a manager so all right so the next one is this one oops Ta -da! see how pack well packaged that is and this beautiful um happy mail or happy package is from the hell the hopefulness huntress uh oh come on that ain't right right there so let's see what we have scored so all right so we have this thank you for packaging it really nice oh i remember this so we have quite a few do i do i really remember it I remember it see see this you all see this this is like someone that actually cares so much about these things and then while well, they all do I would not buy from them if I don't feel like well this is like I think this is a new purchase and then there's like this liner right here so yep so, all right, we're going to start with this one. Um, so, this is well packed, guys. You all see. what? Um, if, in case you're wondering, why the heck is she opening the package? I'm going to tell you. Because these sellers, they took time in actually packaging this. I'm about to share you a video about the two packages that i had to do for my ebay because yesterday or la this morning actually um i sold two pieces on my ebay shop and um i don't wait because as soon as you actually pay for them whatnot is a different beast because whatnot you have a whole show and usually i show like because i listen to crazy lamp lady that has a whole production of how she does it so when i do a show i have 30 to 40 items one time i did a freaking 60 items but i didn't sell that much however after doing the show i can't i can't like um package it because you're kind of like tired and exhausted because you're talking you know especially if you are in my show you can see how hyper i am but anyhow, um, yeah, whatnot is different. 
eBay. I mean, you don't you don't do anything. You just wait till somebody like actually likes your stuff. So she packaged it like this. I remember this seller. This seller is so fun. Oh my god. And actually, this was the one that nobody even cared about until I started bidding on it. So, and I'm so happy I won it because I was really fighting for it. So it has an apple and then it has a flower right here. And then there is a little font that says, to everything there is a season and a time for every purpose under heaven. Dude, that's deep. That's deep. But anyhow, this is artist sign. So she said that she, it started off like five, two dollars, something crazy like that. But I ended up paying more than that. I ended up paying quite a bit because somebody was out trying to outbid me. I don't, um, yeah, six dollars. So look at I, look at me trying to, to um, complain about six dollars. Six dollars for a pottery piece. Do you all see that? So please follow her. Follow her. I was supposed to go to her. Was it her that was supposed to have like a mug show i forgot so but anyhow she was purging so which i have to do but see it's difficult for me because like these these are not my niche that i will sell this girl probably i don't know and then i look at it and i'm like mm, this is one of the kind so i also got these rose medallion right here i'll show you so um it was a set. It was teacup. I thought it was like bowls. But now that I'm looking at it, I would like to use this for um, sauces or to measure my rice. Because as you can see, I'm a person that if you're going to look, I give you um, rice, rice, baby vibes. And I am diabetic, so I have to control that. So this probably, um, I'm going to try to make a portion rice out of these. Oh, one of them chip. Is it supposed to be chip? I can't remember. Um, I was wondering, guys, if you are a seller too. Can you write it in there if I, it's supposed to be chip? Like in the order sheet. Just because I... I don't remember so it takes like three days and I'm I'm not very smart so because then I don't know if that's by transit that that happened or whatever the case may be so please if it's not too much to ask put it in the disclaimer or the the um, description that it's supposed to have a chip Abby you bought it with a chip. I'm almost positive she said it had a have a chip. So one of them have a chip. Because there's three. Right there. Or maybe there's more. Let's find out. I think there's more. So yeah. So this is perfect for like dipping sauces too. Not necessarily tea. Because if it's tea, that's not enough for me. This is the smallest that, um, cup that I would drink my tea. Or the English um, teacup, the porcelain one. But if I use that, I have a, a teapot. So, yeah. Just blabbing my mouth. Nothing. Do you all see this? That she actually packaged this one by one. And she sold this to me for like, I would like to think it's $5 or maybe $2. So yeah, that looks like, I think this is a chip. I'm not going to ask because I didn't pay that much. However, these are rose medallion and I love rose medallion and this camera sucks. Okay, so that's that. Let's put the chip on top, shall we? Okay, all right, the next one. Like, I believe that she was trying to leave and I was trying to sleep and I couldn't sleep and I did not do well i mean of course i managed to do my job i work at the hospital but i had an early start 
and um it was just weird all through but the thing though with my job in the hospital once you're in you're committed you can't you can't slow down because the way that it is you have to have like that upbeat dynamic to do my job or otherwise you won't make it you'll be miserable it's almost like you're telling a story hi oh hi how are you oh okay well thank you for coming in I'll tell you okay this is another lovely piece that i ended up scoring i'm telling you i'm almost positive that it was two dollars no that's not it four dollars for the green mug and then two dollars for two dollars for this so basically um she gave them to me instead of donating thank you i'll use it i promise i'm not sure if that will have an appearance on any of like my social media um or shop because i bought those i bought these because these are my niche and these are a nice pottery mug i'm just opening that part opening opening now the saucer and um show you i have to list a lot of stuff oh god i love pottery um i can't i don't think i should but who cares it's my stuff so it looks like that isn't that gorgeous might take that to work that would be a lovely piece so nobody cares but this is a nice teacup size so and then last but not the least so give her a follow she has awesome stuff and i'm telling you you can't beat this prices like if you go to salvation army like especially my salvation army it's called sal's or boutique they have nice stuff though and it's one of those things that you're stuck that's what you have so it has to be great or otherwise you go to the suburbs then i will get annoyed in the suburbs oh no this is another rose medallion so i only brought three stuff didn't even i did not spend that much and then she packaged it nicely so that's that and then that is it you guys that is our haul for today um tomorrow miss tracy and i will have a date so we're gonna try to do our best to do like a um planning video for you guys i'm not sure depends on what time she comes in because tomorrow um is monday no freak sunday and football day we have our first um like uh what like oh my god very important semi-finals like um finals game not finals i can't talk so i'm just blabbing my mouth there is a lions game tomorrow so i have to be home a certain time i cannot get over this this is so cute thank you thank you thank you i don't know why you're purging it but probably have it we all have our own reason but this is going to stay forever with me because i like that and i love pottery oh it has a chip no it doesn't it's made that way <laughs> all right thank you guys um for watching and please like please subscribe please stop by in our ebay account i'm sorry i haven't had any whatnot um show just because i'm lazy maybe after football i'm gonna try i'm gonna try i'm gonna try just because whatnot is a little bit like a beast and i do not know how to like shop my shop or shop my shelf kind of thing just because i don't even know how to screenshot like oh and i'm pretty sure that mav have taught me like one million times she's very patient with me but i'm just a very challenged person and i'll see you guys soon but we are our ebay shop is loaded and pretty soon as soon as i figure out a white and black background because i don't have like those photo box um i got approved to actually um sell or pass along my hoards 
which is difficult because I have to pick and choose like what I'm letting go. If it's up to my husband, let it go. Let it go. Sell it. Sell it. A whole different video for that. But anyhow, um, watch out for that. And I'm going to make an announcement and I'm going to show you like the first few items that are in there for you. Um, Knickknacks is a, another selling platform that is actually um, affiliated or I think owned by Crazy Lamp Lady or Jocelyn. So um, I'm going to... Um, give you like a formal thing for that but thank you guys for watching and we'll see you guys soon bye